we're going to head upstairs in the Friends Meeting House. Again, here we are on the men's side, and we'll walk through to the women's side. The community of Friends was never huge in Little Compton, but you can get a sense of the size of the building that they wanted to accommodate their flock uh, in the early 1800s. And it was customary for Quakers from other towns to come and visit. So this building would have to accommodate not only the local friends, but also visiting friends. Let's go through to the women's side. Again, very simple, very plain. Um, and really, in my opinion, beautiful in its simplicity. This side is interesting because there are boards around the top of this opening. And in the winter, the friends would, would lay boards horizontally across this opening, blocking it off so that there would just be a small space downstairs. They would close the center panels block off this second floor and have a nice small meeting space that could be easily heated by that one fireplace um, in order to conserve resources. And so in the wintertime, the entire congregation, men and women, would meet down there to worship. And of course, in the winter, it would be harder to get to meeting, and so fewer people would attend. 